guys, it's Chris from Chris's Treasure Chest. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I wanted to do a video on probably the most common question I get is shipping, shipping, shipping. And what I'll do is I'll walk you through on how I set my account up and how it's been working for me. Um, first I wanted to talk to you about a new, another scammer that tried to scam me the, uh, yesterday. Um, he bought an item and um, it was actually a best offer. Actually, we were talking back and forth for a little bit. He was asking some questions. He put an offer and he bought it. And when he sent me the offer, it was a US address. So then he paid me. So I charged him for the shipping to that US address. And then what the bugger did, he changed his address to a Belarus address. So I went to go ship it. It came up Belarus. So I contacted him and said, look, I, I'm not shipping here. When you made the offer, it was to the US address. Please change your address. And he, he writes in broken English, why, you don't do that? I go, no. As per eBay policy and PayPal policy, I ship the verified addresses only. I told him that. So now it's been almost 24 hours. He hasn't got back to me. He sent me, actually he did. He got back to me about an hour ago. He said he's trying to find a US address to ship to. I asked him, what about the address that he made the offer with? and he hasn't got back to me. So I'm giving him till 12 noon today to get his act together and also I'm gonna cancel the order and give him a refund. He was trying to pull one over because I'm a, I'm a high volume seller so maybe I would never have caught it and build him out that way. Um, you always gotta remember guys, if you're new to this business, they will try to scam you the best they can. So you gotta be on the lookout. All right guys, eBay shipping in Canada. What I, what I did is I set up a small business account um, a Canada Post online, it's free of charge. Um, what they did, they sent me a little card and there's an account number and then when you go into Canada Post you can get a discount on um, stamps and boxes and bo whatever they have there. Um, so it's kind of nice to have, but I'll take you through the levels. There's four different levels in the small business account platform. All right, so level one, you get a 31% discount and that is for your purchase or, or your sales or purchases with them from zero to $2,499. Then level two, you get a 37% discount and that's between $2,500 and $4,999. Level three gives you a 40% discount and that is from $5,000 to $7,499. And level four gives you a 47% discount. That's $7,500 up, and that's in a full calendar year, 12 months. All right. So uh, they, what they do is they monitor your 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 buying or, or your shipping labels with them, and they review it every quarter, uh, and they'll adjust you accordingly. If you go below 70 or below five, you go back to level two, and so on. Right. So uh, the next level for me is a commercial account. I mentioned that a couple of got times to you guys um, uh, working on that. Not there yet. Uh, I haven't met the parameters for that level, let's say, to, to move that way. Um, then what you do is you link your small business account to your PayPal and your Shippo so that when you do create your labels, Canada Post knows how much you're buying, how much you're spending, so that your level will stay where it is. And that's the rate you get when you go and um, print it out. I have a new, new eBayer, you know, going, oh, the rates are crazy. I go to small business, you get 31% off. It's a big help, guys, for, for, for shipping. Um, question I get also is, do I offer free shipping? Never. Ever, ever, ever do I offer free shipping. Um, the buyer always pays for the shipping um, and I offer full tracking and insurance only. I've been burned too many, many times in the past, uh, especially when I first started out and I had a very small feedback. People would take advantage of me. Um, I would ship it out, regular letter. Um, I don't know, it could be a $20 item. It would, they would get there, but they say they never got it. They settle with the buyer because of the eBay guarantee and I'm out the shipping, what I paid for the item, and I have to give them their money back. So not doing that. I highly advise you don't. US, guys, shipping in the US is different than Canada. It'll never be the same, unfortunately, right? That's the way it works. 
So, um, but I hope that's helped you guys um, shipping or answering the question about shipping in Canada using Canada Post. I don't use UPS. I don't use any other carrier. Canada Post has been very, very good to me and I have no, no complaints at all uh, with them. Anyways, guys, comment below. Please, uh, any other questions maybe I didn't cover, uh, big thumbs up. Please like the video, uh, share with your friends. And uh, until next time, this is Chris from Chris's Treasure Chest.